how to update driver for your PC. First of all, right click on my computer and choose the property option. Once the new window pops up, click on device manager tab. Now select the driver you want to update one by one. Right click on driver you wish to update and click on property option. When a new window appears, click on driver and choose the update driver option. On the next window, you will be displayed with two new options. The first option is search automatically option. And the other option is browse my computer option. In this option, you can use CD, DVD, etc. For this video, we would be choosing automatic searching option. Repeat the same option for the each updation. Click start and type CMD or you can open your system command prompt as in administrator mode. After opening of command prompt, type sfc space forward slash scan now and click on enter button. Now system start the verification process. This process will take time so you can wait here. If system found any suspicious file so it can delete successfully or replace that file by their own. Thank you guys for watching. Just uh, click on start and type disk. Now press disk cleanup option and just wait for disk cleanup opening. After opening of disk cleanup, you have to clean any file you want from the disk. So most people hit on recycle bin, temporary files. You can choose any of them. After choosing, here is an option. Re rescan. So just click on rescan and that goes to rescan. So just wait for that. After rescanning, you are able to clean this. This process may take time, so just wait here. Okay, after re scanning. Now you are able to clean your disk. Just choose a particular file like window defender, temporary file. You can also check their sizes. Um, it's take 12 GB. Okay. So I scroll so you can see all the options. So just click on their dialog box. Select your particular disk file. After this, you have to click on OK button and for the permanent delete option, click delete. Okay, here we done. Thank you guys for watching. system scanning download malware bytes it's a free version software just download it and open it after opening of this click on scan option and you can see the multiple methods you can choose one of them like thread scan custom scan hyper scan click on custom scan and now choose the particular disk you want to delete C D E whatever you can choose one of them or maybe all of them and now click on scan now option okay your custom scan is started 
after scanning all the devices you can close this software and you easily scan your system thank you guys for watching okay from the desktop click on start and go to the computer right click and uh, click on property option okay so you can see the system information on your screen on the left side you can see system protection option left click on that and this will open up system protection screen so on the system properties click on system protection um, here is a link so this will give you the brief information how can be used or etc the other option is system restore but uh, first uh, we can create the restore point first okay so we can actually manually create the system restore point so the two option one is uh, configure and um, other one is uh, creating option so if you manually create the system restore point so just click on create and type your restore point name anything it can be um, I'm just typing text just create click on create it might take two three minutes okay so now you successfully created your restore point Okay, now click on OK. Um, now we learn how we actually use the system restore. click on start um, and go to the all programs and now we go through the accessories and now on system 2 just uh, click on system restore point ok now go to the next step now we see the restore points both are manually created if you want to see all other points then click on show more restore point test is created by our own now click next then system is going on reboot point okay now that's it okay thank you guys for watching